Jasmine Rich, your favorite YouTube bitch. Ah, uh, ah. Uh, I'm here with an update on my body yaddy 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 Um, cause y'all keep asking a bitch or whatever. All up in my DMs. All up in my business. Oh, yeah, my business. Don't do that. No, sir. But um, you guys know I'm an open book, so I have no problem answering you guys' questions. I'm gonna have my assistant read me the questions. Question number one, when and where did you get your surgery? I got my surgery November 6th um, in Santo Domingo. Welcome to DR, they drive crazy, loco. So I'm about, I'm three weeks post-op and as you can see, I'm serving body yaddy 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 yaddy. Period. <laughs> Hello. Go to the next one. <laughs> Who was your doctor? My doctor was Francisco Rodriguez. My surgery coordinator was Shirley. Love ya. Miss ya. Mwah. Mwah. Ah. No, sir, but they were really good, super helpful, attentive. But beware that nigga don't speak no English. So um, have your Google Translate ready the fuck up. No, so but either way, he's still really good. He got me the results I wanted so far. Even though these aren't my final results. But so far, I'm in love, baby. Tuh. Tuh. Do you recommend your doctor? Of course I recommend him. Look at what he did to me. Ah, ah. No, sir. But yes, I recommend him. He was super great. Um, I, He did everything that I asked him to do. So what I got done was a tummy tuck. So as you guys can see, I'm snatched the fuck up. Purr. 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 So I got um a tummy tuck. I'm flatter than a motherfucker. Flatter than a motherfucker. Um, I got a BBL. And I'm not showing y'all that yet because it's none of your business. No, sir. And I got some arm lipo. So my arms used to be like my biggest insecurity. But now they're fucking so small so thin happy birthday mr president okay sorry next where did you stay i stayed at the recovery house right next door to the clinic which was so convenient i'm so happy i went there um yeah it was called Armonia, recovery Armonia, it's something like that, but it's literally right next door from the clinic. This is the recovery house, y'all. So beautiful. Five stars will recommend. Well, we came back to get Chrissy Pool. You guys have to stay at this recovery when you come here. Tell them Jasmine sent you. This is where I got my surgery, my massages. Ooh, look at the kids, the pick me them. Look at the picnic them. Um, and yeah. How many days did you stay at the recovery home? I stayed for 10 days. It was a long 10 days. It was really emotional. I think I cried for 10 days. No, sir. But um, I did cry. Like, that's the most I've ever cried in my life. Because I'm not even a crier. Everybody knows I'm a real ass bitch. Give a fuck about a nigga. Big Birkin bad hoe. Five, six figures. Start on my ass. No, sir. But, um, yeah. I cried a lot. It's really emotional. You're not your normal self. You can't move like how you want to move. Um, nobody in there speaks English. No, sir. But, um, it was just, it's a lot. It's an emotional lot. So I'm glad I got to be there with other girls. I'm um, going through the same thing. Um, it's so it was. I'm just happy I stayed in that recovery home because I you know I met some really fine people. Chrissy's coming with us. Chrissy's one of my other favorites. Hello. She can't say nothing to me because all she do is make me laugh, and <laughs> I can't laugh right now. Rose too. So. Mm. <laughs> all right, Charles, Jazz and Rich, your favorite YouTube bitch. Ah uh, ah uh, ah. Uh. We're here in the Bad Girls Clubhouse, aka mm. the Recovery House. I'm here with some fine ladies. My girl from Chi Town. <laughs> Bitch, we not from 63rd. Tell them. Tell them. Fine girls, love y'all, miss y'all. Um, Bitch, we not from 63rd. And um, yes, but the emotional part is real. So, tuh. Make sure you have somebody, you know, 
don't try to do this alone break the recovery home if you stay there make sure you told them i sent you so i can get a discount on my next time Vanessa. but i give the recovery home a 10 out of 10 no cat no kizzy no cappuccino no sir but they just never 10 the food was great the nurses was great the service all around was great i was comfortable the bitches i mean the girls there i love them to death love them down it's Jasmine Rich, your favorite YouTube bitch. Ah, ah, ah. I'm here with my, my bitch, Miss Johnny Tsunami. Ah. What's that? Because she get wet in the ocean. Hello? Uh, uh, true or false? Hello, true. True or false? False. Okay. So, um, it was a great, I'm like just really happy I was there, honestly. Like, it was a real great experience. And hello? I got nothing next. <laughs> um likes and dislikes about where you stayed likes and dislikes i'll say i loved why well, you said this but i loved the staff isa mi favorita and i'm her favorite back y'all i love the girls how was your time here with me amazing period amazing period see and those are not her lines i didn't give her no lines to read mm -hmm. amazing she made my time go by fast so fast i'm gonna miss her Everybody is, baby. <laughs> if you had to describe your journey so far in three words. Uh, okay, just describe me in three words. I think that's the most important part. Crazy, sexy, cool. Oh, my God. TLC <laughs> who? Thank you. <laughs> Safe recovery, speedy recovery. And next time I'm down in the hue, I'm going to come see you. Thank you. Ooh, don't get the flies on Thank film. Oh, no one needs to know there's bugs yeah, up in here. Yeah, was, yeah, there's no bugs in here. She was, was something. I don't know she was praying. Was. She was reaching for the God. It was the Holy Ghost. That's all that was. She was praising them. Holy hands. Holy hands. <laughs> the owner was real sweet, too. That's the boss lady. They're real accommodating. It was real inexpensive. It was real inexpensive. It's not expensive. Worth it. Everything included. Um... Everything included, everything you need. Food, nurses, drivers. You made it! You know, just make sure you tip them up how you're supposed to tip, because don't be no ghetto. And don't tell them I sent you then it too if you go there and don't tip, because that's just ghetto. And I don't do that ghetto shit. I don't play the ghetto game. Dislikes, the only thing I disliked was, honestly, it, nothing. The only thing I disliked was me, because I just couldn't sit. I wasn't pooping, you know what I mean? I couldn't sleep. Um, so it was just really uncomfortable, but as for the recovery house, like they did everything they were supposed to do. So I really recommend it. And I really recommend that clinic as well. They're right next door to each other. It makes the most sense to stay there, especially if you are going to book with Mr. Francisco Rodriguez. How much was it? How much was it? You in my business. Don't do that. Don't do that. No, sir. But, um... Um, everybody's different, so, no, sir, get your own quote, you know what I mean? But I'll tell you this, I'll tell you this, I, I, tell, I tell you what, what was Jeezy saying? I, I tell you what, I tell you what, it was less than 5K. Oh, rate your pain. Oh, the pain, baby. <sighs> rate the pain. I'm gonna say this, so the first day, day one's not gonna be bad, because you still have the, um, is it anesthesia? Mm -hmm. You still have the anesthesia um, in you from the clinic. So the day one's not bad. But baby, that day three, hide your kids, hide your wife. Because tough. Ta -ta -ta -ta. No, so, but it's, it was bad. Number one, if you're getting surgery in DR, bring your own um, painkillers. Bring your own perks. No, so, but bring your own medicine because they do not believe in narcotics. In DR, they will prescribe you some weak ass shit and you will feel every bit of it. Pain, I would probably say an eight out of ten. But um yeah, it's it's just yeah, it's more so discomfort. You're sore. I mean, I'm still sore, but I'm not compressed the fuck up. I'm sore the fuck up. No sir. Don't believe nobody who say it don't hurt because they're motherfucking lying. Next question. How was caring for yourself after? After care. I mean, now I do everything by myself for the most part. Only thing I don't do is my own massage, but a bitch just got a uh, infrared massager. Black Friday, hello. So, baby, I'm going to be massaging myself, you know. What is your recovery time? 
recovery time they say three to six months i'm almost a month post-op so i can move and groove you know like my final results are not going to show for like three months so that's why y'all ain't seen this ass yet but y'all can see that Aha! that's it did you have draining tubes and if so how long i did have the drains the drains are super annoying because they're just there and they're nasty you see the fluids coming out it's mostly blood at first um it's real nasty it's a pissy situation um very ghetto wouldn't recommend that's a, but you need your drains because you need to get rid of that excess fluid i had them in for 10 days and i had to get them out baby i was not traveling with drains that's ghetto i didn't even like going to the supermarket in drains like i everybody in dr did not need to know why i came to dr you know what i mean even though i did look like a little dominican girl they probably thought i just fit right in like i was um una chica de dominicana republicana ay 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 os mios Periodo. Nino. You know, sir. But, um, I forgot the original question, but I think I answered it. Um, how was your post surgery massage? Pat, uh, my post surgery massages. So, the first massage, honestly, truly was the best massage I had. Everybody's, uh, everybody's experience will be different. But for me personally, my first massage was my best massage. I don't know if it's because she took a light on her sister, but baby, she was working it, baby. I had to tip her, but the massages are really relieving. They make you feel so much better. Recommendation. I definitely recommend the doctor. I definitely recommend the surgery coordinator. So hit up my girl, Shirley. Tell her Jasmine sent you. Not playing with you. No, sir. But I definitely recommend the doctor. He was so good, so kind, great personality. He laughed at all my jokes, y'all. <laughs> A bitch is making him laugh in English and you don't understand it. But, um... Definitely recommend the recovery home. Your whole trip, like, what do you recommend bringing? Okay, I, okay, so I recommend bringing, you don't even need that many clothes. What I did was I bought, like, 12 dresses for sh on Sheen. Is it Sheen or Shein? I think it's Sheen. Sheen? Yeah. Well, Sheen slash Shein. <laughs> she sells, she sells by the she short. No, sir. But I got 12 dresses from there. I recommend getting your second garment in DR. Or wherever you get your first one, get your second one. Um, just for sizing purposes, I recommend you find, um, a post-op doctor. Wait, no, so I didn't even do that. So let me stop even trying. I can't recommend shit I didn't do. Um, I recommend, you know, the, it, this is just too general for me to answer, but I just recommend you go to my doctor. You have my surgery coordinator. You go to my recovery home and from, they're going to take great care of you. They're going to give you all the recommendations you need. Cause I'm not, a, you know. I'm not a doctor. I can't um, tell you what to do. I'm not a surgery coordinator. I can't really, you know. This is just based off of my experience. So y'all don't do what I did trying to be me. Because you can do what I do and still don't do what I do. Read that again. No, so that's a status on Facebook. But um, you know what I mean? Everybody's different. You're never going to get the same results.